meant to create. Sometimes our desires to create are blocked spiritually, mentally, emotionally, or even physically. And this prevents us from reaching our highest aspirations. If you are an entrepreneur or you would like to become one and you're in need of some sage advice and direction, then you're in the right place. As a successful entrepreneur, spiritual guide, and intuitive business coach, I can offer you the clarity and support you need to find success and reach your goals. With decades of experience as a trusted tarot card reader, a franchise owner, my practical and spiritual approach to entrepreneurship will help you reach your full potential as an established business owner. Whether you're struggling with making tough decisions or simply trying to find your path in life, I can help you learn the tools you need to create your business dream. Take some time today and schedule your free consultation with me so that we can begin to make your business dreams a reality. Hi, hi Libra. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's go ahead and jump into it, Libra. Uh, thank you, God, for blessing Libra with a clear, concise message from you. Okay, catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, Libra. Let's get into it. Let's see what's going on for you. Let's get some advice, then an outcome. All right. Let's see advice, advice for Libra. Let's see advice, advice for Libra. Okay, the Six of Pentacles. When I was shuffling off camera for you, what I was getting was like, scales like something going up a scale I don't know like scaling something maybe you're going up maybe you I don't know you scale build buildings or you clean windows I don't know scales coming you know was was coming up for me or something of that that nature and then it was like blue eyes and like blonde hair but it was like blonde dreads so blue eyes blonde dreads I don't know if that means anything to you let's see how we can incorporate that here the six of pentacles is what's happening so um balance you found harmony within your earthly the earthly realm within your money material of uh, the, the ancestors are uh, or the judgment card with the will of fortune very nice so some of you um this is psychic ability sharing getting paid for um awakening others starting some of you are about to awaken people to their destiny, to where they're supposed to be. And at a point in time, you're gonna get paid for that or you've been getting donations in regards to that. You've been waking people up. Um, you've been getting you know, knowledge of um, expressing knowledge. Um, this is also um, some people donating to you, charity, uh, giving to you uh, because of what you, you've given to them. The two, um, okay, so the, the judgment here, this is definitely using your intuition, um, helping others to wake up to, um, out of the slumber. Uh, this is also um, needing to incorporate something from the past into the now. This is also somebody here, could be Scorpio wanting uh, maybe a second chance or somebody wanting a second chance. Someone's trying to do right or they're trying to make it an equal give and take now. Could be a masculine energy. Could be a soulmate, high level soulmate, I don't know, twin flame, whatever you subscribe to. Um, it's just like a destiny, a part of your destiny, serendipitous or... Um, so, so it's asking you right now um, to decide make a decision either are you in or are you out because it's trying to move you to something else move you to you know another place another space oh that was the scale trying to scale up trying to go up the universe is trying to like take you up to your destiny to where you're supposed to be to where you're going to help other people you're going to open up unlock um 
this is talking about sitting in, uh, amongst new social circle also. It's just like the universe wants you to decide if you, um, if you're doing this or if you're not, um, or if you're in this relationship or you're not, you have the power now. Okay. You're in a very powerful place. Uh, the power dynamic has been shifted. You got the power. Maybe you didn't used to, you used to wait for, or you didn't have enough, or you didn't believe in yourself enough, or people weren't behind you, but it looks like you got a mass of people behind you. Maybe even people trying to show you their de devotion by way of material things. Okay, so giving you money or giving you gifts or, yeah. The universe is, okay, so some of you have been absent from a place for a while, and it's like, are you still doing it? Are you still gonna go after it? Are you still going to? And then some of you, you you're walking into something here. It's just like the universe is going to unlock maybe um, a yeah, new social circle for you, new group. Um, this is could even be yeah, a part of your destiny where you're supposed to be doing your life purpose. This is also um, once you get around these people or whatnot or you start to do this thing, um, you're going to go through the major arcana. Again, you're going to learn how to deal with a, a new group or a new level or a new scale. It's like the universe trying to scale you up for something. What? One more card, because I'm, I'm interested in regards to what this is. Um, wow, page of wands. So this is a big deal. Um, talks about promotion. The universe trying to promote you, put you, put you up. You could be up for a promotion. You could be sitting around different groups or different people. Um, it's just about, oh, you might need to get a makeover or put some time into yourself. Um, yeah, you need to incorporate something from the past into the now. You need to change something, change your mindset, change the people you're around. You need to get a makeover. You need to do something for yourself. Um, you need to have more energy, vigor, uh, vibrance. Um, you need to be willing to explore, okay? Um, you need to be willing to take action if then statement here. So if the universe opens this up to you, then what are you gonna do? Or if you decide, this day that you want to do this thing, then the universe, you know, so that that's, it's like a, if you do, then. So a conditional statement, it's got conditions, you know, uh, associated with this. This is, um, this could even be intuition, um, intellect. This could also be um, magic, um, use the magic of life, doing something on your own terms, or, you know, um, Maybe making, doing your work, whatever, however you make money on your own terms, on your own time, make your own schedule. This is promotion. This is a opportunity to start something big. Wow, this just came out. Queen of Wands. This is definitely magic, a vibration. Whatever you are attracted to yourself, sultry, seductive. The Queen of Wands isn't chase. She just draws it into herself, okay? I'm vibrant, okay? Um, this is life purpose also, okay? This is really, um, this is self-actualization. Knowing that you actually belong here, that you should actually be doing this thing. This is confidence. This is, of course, self-employment, self-direction. Damn, uh, Libra. It's like the universe is like, look, this is where you should be. We're trying to get you there. We're trying to scale something up. Um, are you in or are you out? Incorporate something from the past. Uh, there's a decision that needs to be made here. In regards to maybe a love, what is it? What what is the decision? What is the decision here? I knew it. King of Wands, no King of Swords. This could be you, Libra. Expertise. Ex. Oh, they want you to. I I was getting into. They want you to learn something. So you need to re rewire, rework, relearn, or you need to learn more. You need to have your head in a book. Um, you need to sit around someone who has expert advice, expertise, okay? You need to be more disciplined if you are not. Um, this is a high standard, okay? The King of Swords is of a high standard, has high standards for himself and everything else. So you need to do something, you know, under the regard of high standard. This is also God. The King of Swords is the king closest to God. He sits in the air, okay? Um, so it's like you need to have that godlike quality about you. You need to be um, focused, directed, okay? 
Um, some of you need to find God or find a, whatever you can choose, which God you want to find, right? But you need a God-like quality that you're after, that you're following, that is your guiding light. Um, something about standard too. Raise the standard, scaling up. All right, what is the advice here for Libra? Libra, you've got the most interesting reading. It took me 10 minutes to figure it out. Um, Six of Cups, share your gifts here. Connect backwards also. Release and declutter emotions. Could be dealing with a Scorpio. So it's like you need to do a deep dive in regards to your emotions, your heart space, um, how you deal with others. Um, this could have been someone that you grew up with. Um, this could even be connecting back backwards, generational. Um, maybe even going through the trauma of coming up, of you know, um, you know, being brought up, of your upbringing. Um, this is also simpler times. You need to get back to simpler times. Also, we need to simplify something. You need to make it simple, make it plain. Okay, it's too complicated. Declutter, clean up, declutter your emotions, declutter your space. Also, there's too much junk around you or junk associated with you or somebody's bringing junk. Okay, uh, what is the outcome if Libra takes the advice of the cards? Wow, very nice. To bon, T Bonange, to Bonange. I don't know, I could be wrong, but it's Temperance card, so it looks like. That's the best card to get, uh, one of the best cards to get. So it looks like there is moderation, there is balance, okay? You find yourself again. Um, this could be transfiguration. Um, it's like you are, um, so you're, you're moderating something that was offset. You were doing too much of something, um, too much smoking, too much drinking, too much hanging out, too much overthinking, too much gossiping, too much something that was not good for you. So it's something about moderation and getting back to the feminine and masculine qualities that best, you know, that it makes you, that makes you best to where you can actually um, get things done, taking the middle ground, um, making change happen in your life. This could be some of you needed to go to rehab or um, yeah, get under some expertise so you can move forward. Yeah, the nine of wands just fell out of the deck. Um, so it's like, you've been through a lot, the wounded warrior, you need to decompose or decompress or, you need to come out of depression. Um, something about that. The Nine of Wands also. Um, what is the Nine of Wands? This is um, not giving up before the miracle actually happens. Also, striving. Every day was a struggle to move forward. But it's about moving forward. It's about striving also. What's the Nine of Wands? This is you needing to come to terms with maybe you, you got to stop fighting for a relationship, um, a rocky relationship filled with ups and downs, ins and outs, something that causes you to drink or drug or overdo or overdose, or maybe a relationship causes somebody to overdose here or to overdo. You need to create something better and new for yourself. This is what I have for you, Libra. If you want to get your own personal reading, go over to the website and book your reading there, um, get just like this. Um, and if you are a business-minded individual and you wanna be around other business-minded individuals, sign up for the KTMG monthly conference call. Keep the momentum going call where we uh, talk all things business, how to start, how to maintain, how to further and grow your business, okay? Um, so sign up for that, all links are below. Or sign up you know, to schedule your discovery call, your complimentary discovery call with me, okay? So we can figure out where you are in terms of business. It is not for personal, so don't even try it. Um, get back to the reading. If you feel like you took something from it, you could buy me a coffee. The link is below, guys. And if you have a question, this is a one-off question, you can always text your question to the number below, okay? Um, and if you want to book at the website, keep in mind readings are 40% off. Use code 40 off, 40 off at checkout and receive 40% off. Thank you, Libra. Many blessings to you. Take care.